Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the histological differences among the duodenum, jejunum, and ileum. Duodenum, jejunum, ileum together forms the small intestine. The first part is the, is the duodenum, second part is the jejunum, then the ileum. If you look at the histological structures of the duodenum, jejunum, and ileum, we'll find out that in the duodenum, we have submucosal Brunner's gland. These are the Brunner's gland, and the villi are taller in case of duodenum. Okay, and the jejunum, there is no submucosal Brunner's gland. There is no submucosal Brunner's gland, and the villi are comparatively shorter, broader in the jejunum. And the number of goblet cell is more in the jejunum than that of the duodenum. And if you compare this with that of the ileum, we'll find out submucosal lymphatic nodules, we call it pairs patches, okay, that extends up to the, they are present in the lamina propria, they may extend to the submucosa, mostly they are in the lamina propria. These are the pair spaces, lymphatic nodule. And we'll see the germinal center, the light area is the germinal center here. And the villi are the shortest. And the goblet cell is the highest number in the, in the ilia. So these are the differences. We have the Brunner's gland. Brunner's gland are the mucous gland. Their secretion is alkaline. And they also secrete some hormone called urogestron. And the submucosal gland is absent here in the jejunum. But in the lamina propria of the ileum and partly the submucosa, so we have the lymphatic nodule. We call, call it pairs patches. So what are the regional differences? Brunner's glands are only present in the submucosa of the duodenum. Okay. Pear spaces are permanent clusters of lymphoid nodule in the lamina propria and submucosa of the ileum. It may be present in the, in the lower part of the jejunum but it is mostly present in the ilia the pears patches the number of goblet cells are greater in the jejunum than in the duodenum number of goblet cells we know that goblet cells are unicellular glands they secrete mucus the number of goblet cells are highest in the ilia the villi of the jejunum are narrower shorter and sparser than that of duodenum. The villi of the ileum are the sparsest, shortest, and narrowest. So these are the regional differences between the duodenum, jejunum, and ileum. Okay. So if you look at the, the duodenum, jejunum, ileum, this is the duodenum with the tall finger like villi we have the we have the intervillar space the crypts of liver cone okay and these are lined by the columnar epithelium like other part of the gi tract this is the lamina propria here we have the villi of the jejunum so wider shorter than that of the duodenum and here in the ileum the shortest of all villi here and too much gobbler cell this light stain area are the gobbler cell is also present in the jejunum but by convention it should be more in the ileum and this is the lymphatic nodule that is present in the lamina propria extending up to the submucosa with germinal center the light area here 
again lining epithelium is simple columnar epithelium and the villi contains the lamina propria we got that okay now we got again regional differences pairs patches present in the ilium Brunner's gland is present in the duodenum. No pair spaces, no Brunner's gland in the jejunum. Okay. So, aligned by the simple columnar epithelium. Simple columnar epithelium is present also in, in duodenum. Also, simple columnar epithelium line the duodenum. So, everywhere in the small intestine, lining epithelium is simple columnar epithelium with microvilli there. Okay, so what are the highlights? How can we differentiate between the duodenum, jejunum, and ileum? First of all, Brunner's gland, the submucosal, tubular alveolar gland, they secrete some alkaline substance and also the hormone urogastron. Okay, so these are present only in the submucosa of the duodenum. Here, patches are a collection of lymphatic nodules with junction center in most places is mostly seen in the ileum and pair spaces are the lymphatic nodule with germinal center located in the lamina propria and partly into the submucous of the ileum villi long tall villi are present in the duodenum villi is shorter broader in the jejunum is the shortest and sparsest in the ilium. Gobbler cells are present in the duodenal. Among the lining epithelium, we'll also get gobbler cell, and gobbler cell are more in the jejunum. Gobbler cells are most in the ilium. And that's all about the regional differences between the duodenum, jejunum, and ilium histology so please support my channel please subscribe me share the information with your friends if you have any question please feel free to ask me and have a nice day bye now